me. It's fine. Everybody, I like everybody's new look, including mine. Hey, how many reps did you do of the uh, 225? Uh, I got 24. 24. Right, 24. 24. Okay, is that more than last year? Uh, yes. How many did you do last year? 20. Okay, and you're, what, 335 now? Is that what uh, 332. 332. Uh, are you still trying to lose more weight? Are you right where you want to be uh, now? No, I'm fine. I'm fine. It's, um, uh, I guess my goal weight was to be under 340, so I like to play around 330, between 330 and 335. I feel fine. How did, how, I mean, I think this is the lowest since high school for you, right? So, uh, yes. Yeah. So, how, how different do you feel just on the field? I mean, how does it translate? Uh, I just feel, I feel a little, just a little looser out there. I feel like I can, um, my lateral movements are better. Uh, I'm just a little quicker on my feet. Uh, I can fit blocks a little better. I get off the ball a little quicker. I mean, just, just con the conditioning and the lifting, everything has been pretty much going pretty good for me. What's your nutrition like? What are you, are you eating differently? Um, I mean, I've been eating healthy since I got here, um, so I wouldn't say I'm just eating differently. I, I can say I cut back on how much I was eating. Like, well, how much how much do you eat in a day? I say? mean, it's just pretty much three primary meals, maybe two to three snacks a day, enough. Mm -hmm. has, it, has it been tough for you in the past here? I mean, you know, it's a, t it's a tough grind. Everyone knows that. I mean, is it is it hard? To deal with it all the time, and do you have like a new outlook in terms of that this year, maybe versus past years? Yeah, I would say, um, I would say sometimes, sometimes uh, I can get caught up in the process, or for forgetting the process, or maybe forgetting the goal at the, at the end. You know what I'm saying? So, um, but that's what football take anybody through. It's, it's just like that. You got hard times, you got good times, times when you're down, maybe injuries or anything like that, or maybe off field stuff. Uh, uh, everybody's life is different, but uh, at the same time, like I said, I feel like. Um, I just mature, been a little bit more focused than I have been coming up on my last year. I feel like it's gonna be a good year for us. This is the last opportunity for the senior class to, to prove something and obviously you guys didn't go to a bowl game the last two years. How much do you guys covet this season, this opportunity? How much is this gonna to mean to you? Uh, it means everything to it means everything to us and uh, us seniors and uh, as the younger the younger guys that came in too. They know how important this is, they know that we haven't got to go to a bowl game the last couple of years, um, they know how things have been for us. So everybody just pretty much been been busting their balls just 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 to do everything right, um, stay focused, be on time for for everything and on and off the field. So um, we're just trying to do the best we can do. Along those lines, Alice, you know, said continuously this team is the most mature team he's had here. Have you seen the difference, and how much does that difference make? Uh, it makes a it makes a big difference. Um, uh, I feel I feel like I feel like us as leaders on the team. I feel like we're, we're we're doing way better. We pretty much took over the team, saying this is exactly how we got to do things. We got to be here, here, here on time. We got to do this, this, and that. And everybody's just been following. Is there a turning point for you in your mind and your your maturity? Is there a, like a moment that made you kind of change what you were doing? Um, I, I, I guess I could just say I just. I don't say that was a moment. I mean, losing my best friend last year kind of, had, I, I guess you could say, had a, 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 a part a part to do with it. Um, you know what I'm saying? I was, he was like my brother, you know? I mean, just, he was a lot of motivation for me. And uh, me not me not getting to be able to pick up and call him and talk to him every day like I usually did, uh, it bothered me a lot. So, um, I don't know, I just keep him in the back of my head and, and I just, I just go off him. I, I grind off him and my family and, and my teammates. When you look back on it, how hard was it? You, know, you walk on campus, everybody's saying right away, the first day you're here, this kid's going to be this, he's going to be this, he's going to be this. How hard was it to ignore all that? How much did that kind of hold you back? Just feeling like you had to live up to being the absolute greatest thing that anybody ever saw? I can't say that. Uh, that I ignored it because uh, that was that was in the back of my head every day, um, knowing that I had to uh, live up to the certain potential that uh, everybody was seeing in me. You know, um, I can say it was pretty hard. I came in overweight. Um, I had to get that down. Um, um, I had a couple couple little minor off field things that um, that you know what I'm saying I got in uh, trouble with the team for. And I feel like I just turned everything turned everything around.